some dough. Hello everyone, my curly hair routine. I am so sorry that you guys had to wait so long. I've been working on my Halloween videos and they're almost done, but I, I promised you guys this, this would be my, bleh, I can't even talk because I'm so excited. I promised you guys that this would be my next video. Uh, so here it is. Y'all been waiting, but stay tuned for the very end because I'm gonna show Bernie's routine as well. I'm screaming at the camera, probably scaring my neighbors. So I'm starting off with a deep conditioner because I need to keep my curls moisturized at all times. I do this once a week. If you guys want a video of my favorite deep conditioners and products that I use, then comment down below. And then next, I take my wide tooth comb and I comb through my tangles. I never start from the top though. I always start from the bottom just to avoid breakage because sometimes my hair gets really, really tangled. So I just detangle it gently and then afterwards, I start combing it towards my face. And I do this because I think it just looks better when my hair is brushed forward uh, while it's drying. I think it frames the face nicely now the most important part you have to re-wet your hair after you brush it out you can't just brush it out and go well I mean you can but I don't ever do that because when I re-soak my hair it makes all my curls like re-stick together and this basically is the most important part of my curly hair routine is re-soaking my hair and then scrunching it and even though my hair is naturally curly I scrunch my hair because my longer layers tend to not want to curl up so it just kind of helps like encourage my longer layers to curl up as much as my shorter ones and then afterwards if I'm not going anywhere I take like this scarf and I'll just kind of pile all my hair into the scarf like a little turban and it just helps it kind of like soak up the moisture and it also kind of dries with volume in the roots but usually I, I need it dry fast and this is a blow dryer with a diffuser attached to the end and this is how I work this guy I basically uh, take my hair from the ends and I gently gather it up to my root and I hold the blow dryer with the diffuser attached on the end up to the hair that I have gathered onto the root and I hold it there for like 20 seconds and I just keep repeating this process. It takes me like 20 minutes or so to get my hair like 80% dry or 90% dry um, because using a diffuser does take longer than a regular blow dryer because it's spreading out the air evenly and more gently than a regular blow dryer without a diffuser attached but in return you get like really soft curls like this um, without any frizz at all if you do it properly. So I love it so much and you can see my hair starting to kind of dry. I've used no product, I've used no serum, I've used nothing and I just really love how it turns out when I have a diffuser attached and afterwards I just kind of start like moving my hair around and flipping it I don't really run my fingers through it too much because that will create more frizz that I don't need and so I just kind of like flip my hair all to like one side maybe or sometimes I'll even like put it in a ponytail and for my sister this is my twin sister Brittany if you guys are new to my channel but most of you guys are very familiar because I'll, like you guys have been requesting her curly hair routine for like a, over a year now because she has like the biggest longest curly hair ever and um, our routines are very similar but the only difference is that she doesn't have as many layers as I do so she starts off with some hair serum and then she just kind of like gently applies it to the ends of her hair like so just evenly and then she just combs it through and hands me chunks of her hair out of the brush and then afterwards she takes and she starts brushing her hair forward also towards her face but as you can see, like she keeps pretty much all of her hair forward, even the hair from the back. Um, she brushes everything forward, which is a little bit different than what I do. I only brush the parts that frame my face forward. And then after that, she scrunches her hair and then sits underneath our hooded dryer. We have a hooded dryer, as you guys know, and she prefers to use that instead of the blow dryer. And it takes her like, I don't know, 15, 20 minutes of sitting there. And then afterwards, she gets out of the dryer and she just starts shaking her hair around. And this is just kind of loosen up her curls and get everything all bouncy and stuff like that. And then she just moves it all to one side like so. And then the only thing she does after that is she just adds some shine spray to her hair. Hit me, baby. And that pretty much concludes Brittany's curly hair routine. And it also concludes my curly hair routine. And I hope that this helps you guys. And Comment down below what type of texture hair you guys have, whether it's curly hair or straight hair or wavy hair, and I'll try to do more videos aimed towards specific hair types. So I hope that you guys like this video, and I will see you guys very shortly. Okay, I love you. Bye.